It is. Yeah. By the way, one Overlord going down is going to supply block our Zerg player for a little bit now. This is like, uh, this group can't live, basically. Uh, Soma, I mean, it's so far out in the map right now. But this is what Sari wants, is for these Mutas to come in. Well, I mean, what oh he wants is to win it, but. He's killed so many Mutas in this game. Yeah. I mean, it, it is kind of crazy. Yeah, yeah. You need to get that Muta count up to a certain amount. And now he's going to be able to come in here and pounce on this base. Man, really oh nice gosh. play here from Sari. Look at that. Killing off this third is so big. Now, he hasn't killed it off just yet, but there's more reinforcements coming out on the map. Again, it seems like every time our Zerk just gets a little bit too close, the targeting here is so good. And now he can, um, he's going to finally save this, but we're never seeing the Zerg really get over eight Mutalisks. Yeah. Uh, again, now supply block. The Zerg, whatever they have, is what they're going to have to use. And this is a creep colony, not even a sunken colony. And actually, in kind of a rare twist here, being supply blocked and losing overlords might be the final killing blow here on the Zerg, as you just can't get more out. Yeah. In fact, if he does this fast enough, he can kill the hatchery. Let's see, the mutas are going to come back, though. Well, this is really bad. The oh, my God, he's going to get it. He, he gets it. He gets it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Great targeting on these mutas as well. Okay, he decides it's better to with the hatchery dying. That's a very unusual situation where the natural actually ends up going down. I think we actually might oh. even see the Zerg just tap out. I think Terran basically got the attack off, made the turrets. We know that vessels are inevitable. Um, and it also seems very clear that Zerg can't do anything. Speaking of Muta Zartosis, there's been this one mosquito flying around us this entire show. I know. We've not been able to kill it. We've been trying to swat it down this whole time. GG. Wow. We don't kill the mosquito, but... But I think the positioning... Sometimes positioning against Lings is all you need. Yes. He needs another SCV, I think, in front of the well, bunker. It depends on it. Let's okay, see. Hold on. Okay. Oh, that drill. The drill is so perfect. good. Perfect. Perfect. It's so sexy. Okay. Oh. Dude, Soma's really good, but here he is again, having some trouble. A lot of times their follow-up is to just make more Lings and hope you try to attack out and they kill you then, and then they win the game. Oh, absolutely. And so just staying back is a lot of times your best bet. Ooh, nice pick off on the fire bat. Fire bats are, you're actually not going to be able to afford too many fire bats uh, against two hatchery muta. You've got to kind of utilize your gas, get up to some sort of splash damage. So. Okay, so the mutas are going to come in here. Now, these turrets were just barely not done in time. Now, yeah, he, is he going to finish that? I, I can't tell if the turret's being repaired here, but there's two sunks set up over here. I don't like this play from Sorry to be honest, but... Well, when the Lings get in there, it might be a different story. I can't believe you didn't Oh, hold on, hold on. They'll, these Lings are pretty soft enough. He might actually be okay. And this counterattack here from Sorry. Let's see what he's got. He needs to regroup yeah. before he attacks in. Oh, oh he doesn't have enough. Excuse no, me. No, he definitely doesn't. Like, oh, wait maybe a he gets that, but the Mutas are coming back, so I guess that's good. He has four medics with this. This is going to be a painful loss when this all goes down. Nice micro. Ooh, those lings in the side of the main. He needs to turn him into Bane Lings Artosis. <laughs> yeah. I've seen this before, okay? I have too. Right now. There's like four mutas in there with one HP. Yeah. Normally, the muta clumps are very good because each Marine will target a different muta, but when you have that many at low HP, they're all going to die at once. <laughs> <laughs> it's like really yeah. funny. Yeah, you attack move against this type yeah. of thing sometimes. Okay, there we go. Okay, he's starting to hit it a little bit. His micro a little bit better, okay. We don't just hear Muta's dying nonstop, so that's that's a change. Uh, unfortunately, he's now going to go through the main. Is there enough turrets where this gets just stuck? Oh, God. Oh, man. I'm actually surprised that many Muta's in the group stayed alive. It's pretty impressive. The problem is that you can't get out of here without eating. Pressuring right now, he's trying to force Lings out of his opponent or anything like that that he can. Okay, so if he can cover this SCV. Ooh. Know, every, okay, now notice how he's targeting Target each individual link. This is very important. Oh my God, he gets two in. Wow. Well, even getting those two in is amazing. Oh. Look how many links he's forced. He killed that drone there. This is this is so successful. And now he's doing oh, just a one base, two barracks play. Yeah. Which against this is amazing, is, again. Now, if he can just target down the weaker Ling and just micro these Marines right, I think we're getting closer to closer here. Oh, Sorry, just is playing. 
such a great game here. Oh my God, a third one gets in, and that means. <laughs> I he, like. I think theoretically he can save the hatchery here. Yeah. Well, I mean. But this situation is so good for Sari and so terrible for Selma. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he's even got a wall in, so you can't counter with speedlings. And he's actually going to set this up so that he doesn't expand. Instead, it's going to be where he wants to do So instead, try to dive in here. Now, don't forget, he doesn't have range. Just stim right now. Right. And so a, little bit a harder good angle for the mutas can do a lot of damage. He's trying to buy a little bit of time to get the rest of his units up. But Soma actually jumping upon this. Yeah. Wow. Very well done. Very well done. And now it's just these three Marines. Now, these two Firebats are going to come in here and try to get as many drone kills as possible. Yeah, he's splitting them up, but look at that. The drones run from the natural while the mutas chase the firebat into the main. Good catch. This was a perfect defense. That's the Soma I came to see today. I was hoping Sari was actually going to back up when he got close to the natural and regroup. Zerg is probably going to come back and win this game. I just don't. I still do worry for our Zerg, though, in a, in a more normal game, right? This is sort of the Terran overextending. You get one good engage, and this is why we don't see one base play very often. Yeah. Uh, from the Terran side of things, is that it's very unforgiving. You know, it usually is. Uh, all defenses for basic one base play are mapped out on all sides. Pretty much. It, it's just really hard to do much after you lose a few units because your production is so low. There's not that many variables going on. Still trying to hold here. Loses his barracks, so you can see the type of damage that's going down. I mean, eventually he'll even kill the turret via glaive bounces. Yeah, that's the funny thing about glaives is that, you know, it, it's easy to forget that they have the glaives, but because you, know, you need them together as a team to take on this army in the middle of the map, especially as we're entering the five racks uh, play here. All right, let's see where he goes. Okay, it looks like he wants to dog the army, maybe? Is he going to dart in at all and see what's going on? Because with this five racks play that we're seeing, I feel like if Soma can scout exactly what's going on build order wise from Sari or figure it out by the amount of Marines coming out. Oh my God, look at this micro. Yeah, he should have probably run onto the bridge, but uh, here comes some more reinforcements. Looks like only one Marine from that initial group actually manages to survive. You know, it's very, it's very difficult to move Medic Marine like this. Mm. The medics tend to follow the injured Marines and heal them. The Marines bump into each other. Each Marine, even though it's oh. Soma is choosing all the best places right now to actually engage. His lurkers, though, are they too late? Only two sunkens. That's an easy clear. Yeah, that's right. And now we have uh, the lurkers morphing, but reinforcements are coming in. Now just one sunken colony. The lurkers are not out yet. Oh my god, are these mutas actually going to save him? I think they are. Those lurkers are going to hatch in just a moment here. He's picked off just about all of the marines. More marines are coming up, but they are not going to be able to break that before the lurkers burrow. Yeah, he needs to back out. Now, four lurkers, there's no way in hell you're going to get close to no. getting in there. But Soma <laughs> actually going for a dive here. One lurker does get taken out, and the rest of this army is going to get cleaned up. Oh, right, right, tasteless. This was beautiful from Soma. Now. He's going to go right into oh the Oh, my God. Yeah, this is smart. Look at this. this He's pressuring the front. Everything's at the front right now. Okay, now we have the um, Scourge coming in here, but he doesn't actually see oh it. Oh, my God. A huge drop going down. One of the dropships gets picked off, but this is a gigantic amount of Marine Medic. Yeah, that's right. He comes in here. He's immediately going to kill the Defiler Mound. One Dark Swarm goes down, but not enough time to save that Defiler Mound. It goes down. Now the Spire is going to be targeted. Oh. That goes down as well. Oh, huge amounts of damage going down. A uh, Defiler and Lurkers down oh, there. One Ultra spawns here. There's so much, though. Yeah. Okay, he's targeting that down. Again, remember, every unit counts. He does take out the Lurker and the other Lurker, Ooh. and the Ultra goes down as well. <laughs> Just an awesome play by Sari, though. He got really important tech. Some of the units. Now, it. oh, my God, the Lurkers aren't here anymore. Yeah, I don't know how they... Oh, he must use them to like flank or something. Or maybe or? they got killed off. I don't. I actually do not know. Yeah, not sure. But oh my guess God. what? If he kills this base, well, I guess the ultra's here, so probably not going to happen. If he can get really good positioning, maybe. Well, that is an ultra list, though, tasteless. Yes. Go behind the minerals. He's only got 12 supply of Terran units there. Okay, he drops over here, and he get oh behind this. Oh my God! Did he can't... actually get behind the minerals? This is amazing. He is doing so much damage everywhere at once right now. Sorry, so clutch this game. Okay, uh, he's going to send that back. But he, again, he has some push potential here. He did so well. Or maybe not. Maybe he wants to go for just Ling Ultra. Is yeah. That, is that what the, I think the you plan? stay Ling Ultra here. Wow. Okay. He's going to have that fourth carapace pretty soon. 
uh, really any time now. He still has the Defiler. We saw that Dark Swarm come down here. Yeah, yeah. I think it might be better Ooh. to actually go for D-Matrix here, but... Good, good irradiates, though. It gets a lot of the Ultras there, dealing quite a bit of damage. Now, it looks like Soma is starting to break this third base area a little bit. Yeah, Soma's going to drive these SCDs out, but I think he could come in here with enough Marine Medic. Maybe not, man. There's so many Ultras out here. Yeah. What a funny I game. I bet you it's 4K or Pace now as well. Yeah, he must. That should have been finished. They're not right clicking on the Ultra to show us, but seems like it. It seems like these units are just not dying. Well, he's done a lot of damage here. He's keeping him back. This feels like a Soma victory right now. Yeah, it seems like it. When you see the supply differential like this, it starts going real well for Zerg. Oh, he doesn't actually have the fourth care base. Wow, okay. But still, you know, there's a decent amount of vessels. There's just not that many Marines. You really need like three, four <laughs> groups of Marines against this type of thing. Yeah. He needs to find them where that other Defiler is. He has the vessels. He can go kill it. Then it's no more Dark Swarm. That's a huge improvement here. Yeah, that would and be. And here's the other thing, Artosis, just to point out. You can send those vessels out and do the eraser because there's what? No Spire? <laughs> That's No true. Scourge? You can actually That's just true. go over there. But never mind. GG. All right. Can to go to game five? Fighting. There's a hatch up there, but there's not. By or the way, it, sometimes you go in really weird directions because Zerg doesn't have vision everywhere. Oh, so you're and trying to And if he just... loses track of where this is, it becomes very scary. Right. Oh my gosh. Now this Overlord's going to be picked off. Yeah, he's doing really well with this group. Yeah, he's playing excellently. Soma will eventually clean this up. Yeah, the Lings are going to come in. They can absorb a few extra shots and allow the Mutas to clean this up. And that's a strong kill there for Soma. Wouldn't be surprised if that's what we're going to see, in fact. He's done a good job of uh, reducing the Marine count a bit. You can see, actually, it's a little bit scary for Sorry. Look at those supplies. It's a really good supply for Soma. He's got a healthy drone count. He's got a decent amount of mutas continuing to tech up. And he's keeping Sorry back for now. Wow, just cleaning up these Marines wow. over here. Beautifully done. And now Terran's kind of boxed in. Again, I think Sorry, I get the idea of trying to come out and control the map, but now Zerg has so much power here. Knocking out some of these turrets coming back here. This is a whoa lift. Uh, lifts the CC. Yeah. Uh, just it, wants to make sure the Marines can run under there if they need to. The amount of damage is insane right now. Look at this. He's killing so many SCVs. <gasps> so much play in the game. He needed to play here. Now he can actually once again get out. He carved a, a little exit here. Oh my God. There's just not enough Marines here. And you know there's turrets on the outside, but once you get inside the Terran's base. You yep. can just give such a beatdown over here. It's so brutal. Yeah, this position, if they get on your main minerals, it's very painful. And sorry, suddenly very sorry that he lost those Marines in the top right. Just doesn't have enough to hold these off. Look at that, more yeah, Mutas coming in. Yeah, I think he's going to just flatten them here. We were talking about Guardians, and that could have been a possibility, but now he just has so much it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. And I think that's going to be the killing blow here. You're yep. On, yep, there is GG.